it's reached the point where we've arrived. I mean, it's so hard to be social, the social animal most folks like to consider themselves. They want to talk to you. They want to hear what you're saying. Who are they? We'll get back to that. Right now, what we want to talk about beyond them wanting us to talk to them is to figure out what is real when it comes to talking. <clears throat> is the honesty? Are we sincere? <clears throat> I mean, we want to be social animals, but do we want to be transparent in our relations? Do we want to really get to know a person by even willingly sacrificing letting ourselves be known and shown first? They gave us cell phones and they figured that would get us going. And it did. Matter of fact, cell phones has us going, way going, to the point where we can sometimes seemingly step off the planet. It, it, inadvertently, it seems we step off the planet to a point now where we're so caught up in electronics and the methadone reality, the zombie-like craze that it, just like methadone, I mean, because it ain't no snitch, <laughs> methadone is a bitch. And so is social media and cell phones and electronics that we just have around and aren't using as an asset, but nothing more than a liability. Something we pay monthly, a provider to provide. And look all around the house like we're losing our mind when we can't find it. Now, they knew. Who are they? The devaluer. We'll get back to that. They knew. Yes, them, the devaluers that we'll get back to. They knew that they would drive you so insane talking through a machine to a machine that used to be a human being. Check that. Through a machine to a machine that used to be a human being. And now they're ready to sell you the new thing. What's that? Someone to talk to. You've had enough with the phone. You've OD'd on that. <laughs> Cancel Christmas. You've 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 overdosed a dose of the most when it came to the cell phone toast. Yeah. It got to the point where cell phones were so exciting to have and to get the new one that massages your goat's testicles and made French toast while you were having a dose of the most and still able to click over into the next app. Check that. You know, it was just about that. <clears throat> now, they have something for you. Someone you can talk to. And it doesn't have to be a machine. Right now, you can pay to come talk to me. That's how they feel. I speak for free because speaking for free is speaking freely. You know, I'm not going to say you know what I'm saying. I'm not into you know what I'm saying. It's not important if you know what I'm saying. All I need is for you to listen. And if you hear something, you'll show what I'm saying. I don't have to ask you. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I don't need to know if you know what I'm saying. Why? Because if you do identify, it'll show that you know. So I won't need to know if you know. You know, see, got it? Can you identify? Take that, hold that, and let that be that. The next new non-toxic drug they're going to sell us is the opportunity to talk to one of them. It won't be so creepy anymore or weird talking to a psych or anyone uh, uh, with a headlight on there while riding a bike. And it, it won't be weird anymore. It'll be the thing to do because the end crowd is selling it to you. And when you start recognizing that you are the in crowd and those who you think are the in crowd have sold out of the crowd, you'll wake up and you'll feel grateful. No need to feel proud. Take that, hold that, and let that be that. You guys enjoy today. I just felt like sharing that.